wow, I've got to share this, only because it confirms the 5G thing. Uh, you know what people were, you know, saying uh, back in the springtime about Wuhan and, oh, the only reason so many of them died is because they had already got the vaccine and then they turned up to 5G. Well, we had no proof. I mean, they were saying it, right? All right. This says, weaponized 5G test caught live outside Mexico City. This is from World News Desk, the 3rd of September, 2020. It has 22,437 hits already. Okay. And there's a picture of it first, and then it says, It appears the rumors, that's the word I was looking for, Surrounding the new 5G cellular system. Let me check my position. Okay, at least I'm in the middle. Alright. That they can be turned into actual deadly weapons simply by turning the power way up may be true. I said may be true, may. Yesterday, I was given a heads up by some of my former colleagues within the Intel community to pay very close attention to weather radar in Mexico, just outside of Mexico City. It was an extremely odd thing for them to tell me I did as they suggested late last night, so this would have been on the 2nd. He typed this up on the 3rd, so he's saying late last night, so on the 2nd, I quickly understood why I was told to watch. It appears, and he put appears in all caps. The 5G cellular system outside of Mexico City was tested at full power. The effect was so ferocious it actually appeared on weather radar. Now he types all in all caps and then puts dot 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 weather radar. So I'm not real sure if something was cut out on purpose or what. All weather radar is, is how and then exclamation mark. Below are still images of weather radar from at least two different radar sources. Now <clears throat> you see a storm going on up here in the United States in the breadbasket, you could say, the very center. And you see the greens and the blues and the yellows. And then down here and right above Mexico City, it looks like a fried egg, sort of. And then you go down and you get to see it all enlarged. Well, while I was looking at the first picture and I had it up real close like this, I said, that almost looks like the coronavirus uh, picture they show, you know, with the round thing and then there's a round thing inside and then there's spikes coming out everywhere. Well, I scrolled down and I was like, wow. It does look like, kind of, kind of, looks like the coronavirus <laughs> picture on a, on a hill of a golden yellow color. 
Now it's completely gray in the middle like the rest of the picture, like the rest of Mexico. It's gray. Okay, and in the very center is gray. But then you get this bluish green circle and then you get a broken line of like a navy blue and then you get the golden rays coming off of it but then a uh, little ways out you get some more of that bluish green color that's around the gray part streaking out like this you get the point kind of like a sunburst in different colors and they go off into the golden color I'll get it I'll get a um, what you call it hopefully it won't be too big to if it's too big I'll just make half of it okay because sometimes they won't let me put my snapshots up because they say your picture is too big okay so now down here well here they got a little one I could get a picture of the little one and this shows Ventusky V-E-N-T-U-S-K-Y Ventusky Ventusky it's an app and it explains all the colors like if it was a weather thing I can't read it he says I am endeavoring let me check my position alright I am endeavoring to determine through other channels if there was any noticeable effect on people animals or property in the geographic region affected if I get such info I will report it as an update now for subscribers only is additional information about this issue oh okay how about that for a um, solicitation including some details from a story this site ran earlier but withdrew which claimed the 5G network would be used to create kill zones inside the USA during October and by November we would see about a 70 percent population die-off within the USA easing the way for communist China to physically take our country hmm yeah I'm glad they withdrew that that's not gonna happen if that if there's that many people dying it's gonna be from Russia and China invading and that I just don't believe it I'm glad they withdrew it okay now who wrote this I I'm gonna go ahead and try to capture this picture in case that big one that other one won't go up let's try this one I'll just get part of this storm in the USA and I can get all that okay all right. I didn't catch a name. The World News Desk. It just says World News Desk. Anyway, it shows up like a weather event. So if anybody sees any videos where people just fell over dead just above Mexico City 
send me the link to that one. Okay? I hope not, but uh, if that's the result of what they did in Wuhan, I don't know, might take, it might take the um, vaccine first, you see, because that's going to put metal particles in a person. And combined is what I think is going to do the job. That's what I believe. So with that, I'm going to say bye for now. I will talk to you later.